Welcome back to the channel, Loving Life Mallorca. I'm Andrew, and people have often said to me, where do the locals go and do their shopping? For the clothes and things like that. Well, this is where we are today. This is Fan Shopping Centre, just outside Palma. Only a few minutes drive from the airport. So we've got a great big car for here. We've got lots of shops with clothes to cafes, restaurants, the whole caboodle behind me. So without further ado, let's go and see what's up for sale. So this is one of the entrances into here. There's a double floored place. Up just up there, you've got more cafes and shops and different things. Down here, you've got plenty of shops. This is a little frozen yogurt place on the left. Plenty of cafes of the same. And lots of the shops you'd expect to see from H&M. There's even a Primark's in here as well. Lots and lots of shops to choose from. There you go, Benetton upstairs, that's a big one. This is only 15 minutes or so away from the airport, so if you're early, it's well worth popping in here. There's a Pandora just there. Plenty of security on, around here, as you can see. Levi's for your jeans. They do a lot more than jeans now, don't they? T-shirts and things. And it's a big Primark down the end, a double floor Primark, it's huge. As you can see here, today is the first day when you, you don't have to wear your mask. It makes a lot of difference, especially now it's getting a little bit warmer. It's still advisable, as you can imagine. But some of the shops like you to still wear them, others aren't so fussed as it were. But it's up to you to decide really what you'd like to do isn't it if it's if you think it's advisable put it your mask on that's primark in front of us that always intrigues me the television on the on the ceiling just here i think it's brilliant is that got plenty of car park spaces as well that's one of my main um, problems if you like. It's always finding a parking space in it when you go somewhere. But here they've got underground parking, on top parking. Everything you think of, obviously, in the summer we always try to go downstairs because it's always a little bit cooler in it. And on my left here, as you come around, this is a Primark store. And the prices are just just as cheap as Britain, aren't they? Sort of next to nothing, really, isn't it? Four euros for a, a blouse or shirt, whatever you want to call it. It's it's ever so cheap, and they're open from ten in ten in the morning till ten at night. And upstairs there's a big cinema. They do play some British um, films, you know, with English and Spanish subtitles. So quite a few cinemas on the island. Also we've got Starbucks just over there if you do need your caffeine fix. But if you like your electrical stuff, washing machines, computers, things like that, this is Media Mart. This is, um, a huge place to sell just about a little bit of everything really I'd say um, kettles and toasters as you can see some electric bikes 2000 that electric bike there but it does look nice doesn't it I must admit gives just about everything you need in there I haven't got one of my own but I think these powered scooters for a better word were a brilliant idea I really do <laughs> You said plenty of greenery around here and places to sit down and have a have a drink or whatever. <laughs> Not a shelter. It's a party shop just over there. We bought a few bits in there over the years. Um, for different parts of the season I think. 
Not often we'll see an empty shop in here, which I think is good, but this is uh, an empty shop. Hopefully it won't be empty that long. I'll tell you what I do like about here. There are places to charge your phone as you're sitting there. We you bring your, your cable, you can plug it in. It's down there with the electric socket as well to charge your, charge your scooter. I think it's a, as I said, I think they're pretty marvellous to be honest. Have a little cake shop here. Nice to have a, a cup of tea or coffee and a cake in the afternoons, isn't it? Now this is something I've only ever seen here. I've never seen one else. You put your you put your money in, and you can put straight onto your Instagram, Facebook, or whatever. You can put photos and things if you want to stand next to somebody famous and pretend you met them on you go i think <laughs> it's a bit cheating really in it but it's all a bit of fun in it lovely and busy in it for a tuesday afternoon i just see we've got a lovely jewelist here so if you are planning on getting engaged over here, or you've lost your watch, or it's broken or whatever, you don't want to get one from the looky looky people. You know, genuine Rolex, only 10 euros. Yeah, by gum it is. So that's the proper place to go to. Or one of them. This is gonna go upstairs now and have a little look, see what's going on up there. So up the escalator we go. There's a lift as well if you're, if you're um, unable to walk. First thing you'll see the cinema, which is right in front of you. Which is a bit an odd one actually, to be honest with you, because you have to go in a separate building to buy your tickets. Okay, in that, that off um, shop just there, that's where you buy your tickets before you go into the cinema. I mean, normally the, the tickets for sale in the cinema themselves, aren't they? So this is upstairs for you. So when you're up here, you'll find lots more cafes type of things, pizza shop just on your left there, restaurant and things. That's your lift I was telling you about there. If you wanna, if you can't walk up the steps or the escalator. If you know me, I like, I've got a bit of a sweet tooth, haven't I? So the old Dunkin' Donuts, I do quite like a donut. just gives you some idea of how many car park spaces there are here. Obviously you've got a lot more downstairs, but you've got a Burger King over there, drive through Burger King. Just around here, this is car four, you can just see over there. As I said, we've got some loads and loads of restaurants up here. If, depending on what you fancy, you'll definitely find it up here. There's a little ice cream shop there as well, Ben and Jerry's. definitely an outside eating area isn't it Mallorca so we're the 20th of April today so really it's just before the season starts in it as well or early season whatever we can look at it and it is a bit on the windy side today but even the, the wind does feel slightly warm it's not doesn't make it really cold just look at the, the um, sky tiles they look ever so nice don't they it's, I don't know, it's strange. It's a lovely place, really, to come and have. Spend an hour, a couple of hours around here, have a meal. That's Levi's again downstairs. Plenty of toilets everywhere. Who'd have thought it, a eh? DM. Stop to Martin's boots, eh? So down the end there, it's just the top part of Primark store. That's where you'll find the, the gents clothing at the top. It's, it's loads and loads of clothing in there, as you know, and it's all ever so cheap, you know, really.
So even though we're early in the season, there's still a lot of aeroplanes taking off every few minutes or so. I mean, it's only when they start flying you appreciate what, if you like, what we haven't had for the last few years, i.e. the tourists. Oh look, cro Crocs. I don't know if that's only just arrived, but I've only just noticed it. And if you like your fashion, we've got JD for your sportswear. So that gives you an idea of the Primark store, doesn't it? And the same, don't forget it's downstairs as well as upstairs. And it goes back a long way as well. It's, ever, it's huge, it really is. It's quite surprising. Looking down again at Starbucks Cafe down there. I'm saying lots and lots of places to sit down, especially with children's areas as well for them to, to play and things. So if you do like your designer clothes, etc., and do like a little bit of shopping, well, this is probably one of the in places to come to, if you like, it's quite big. You can waste a good amount of time here, but it's not really that easy to get to, to be honest with you. We're right next to the same, we're right next door to the airport. So it's just nice to come in here. If you're, um, you know, if you've got to go to the airport and you're a little bit early or whatever, it's just a nice place to come. So we're right back to the beginning again now. That's a sports shop. It is in there, that's quite a big shop, but big shop, sports shop as well. And there's security everywhere. So that's the corner of Benetton. United colours of Benetton. They do do the windows really nice, don't they? So that's my little walk around the shopping centre done. It's called Fans, F-A-N-S, which is just in Palma, which is by the airport. So if you like it, please give us a big thumbs up, subscribe if you haven't already, and don't forget the Facebook page, Love and Love New Yorker. As I said, there's also a huge car full shopping centre here as well. It is massive. Take care of yourself. I'll see you in the next film. Bye for now.